Hello, this is how to install the application JetBrains Toolbox on Ubuntu. JetBrains.com, the website, on the top main menu, Developer Tools, Toolbox App, We have just one possibility, Linux 64-bit x86 Intel, tar gzip, download. We're going to save into the downloads directory. And it's a tar gzip, we could extract either by going right click and extract. Or we could use the command line tar minus extract z vf. So extract tar gzip verbose okay so there's just one file inside why do they zip this file because the file has the execute mod bit um, set. That means we can double click on the file. It's a ELF AMD64 executable. Graphical user interface application. I double clicked on it. We we'll need to wait for um, the needed resources to be, I don't know, extracted. There's a probably a Java runtime environment there, and um, Swing graphical user interface UI probably. I agree. Start and that's about it. Now it should be available in the start menu. JetBrains toolbox in um, the category development. As an extra step, I'm going to log in. It asks if I want to go from the web browser towards an application. Although the web application seems to be still doing things, the toolbox application says that I am logged in correctly. So this should be it. Extremely simply, simple steps to install an application. The application will work correctly on most uh, Linux operating systems that use AMD64 instruction set architecture, so Intel CPUs, and the application is a must-have for me because I use some of the JetBrains integrated development environments, and this application allows me to install them correctly on Linux. There's, it's not so easy to install a JetBrains application correctly by just downloading the tar gzip and putting it somewhere. It's best if we use the tool that knows how to manage JetBrains integrated development environment applications on Linux. And this tool is a toolbox. It's very easy to install any of the JetBrains applications that you want. I probably want PyCharm and CLion and also Android Studio. Additionally, so this is by clicking on the install button you're going to install the application. Additionally, you can 
select other versions of the JetBrains application than the very last one. So you can, for instance, uninstall the last version of PyCharm and install the penultimate version of PyCharm. And also the fact that the application integrates with uh, your JetBrains account means that the, this uh, toolbox application is going to be able to manage both um, free, so no cost JetBrains applications, but also commercial applications that will require that you have a um, JetBrains account for. This is it. This is the way I install JetBrains integrated development environments on my Linux systems. I always install Toolbox app first, and from there I manage my JetBrains applications. Thank you.